10th. The 10th question says, from a class of 25 students, 10 are to be chosen for an excursion party. Okay. There are three students who decide that either all of them will join or none of them will join. Okay. And how many ways can the excursion party be chosen? All right. So from a class of 25 students, okay, there are 25 and 10 are to be chosen. Select 10. Three students who decide that either all of them will join or none of them will join. Let's say, let's say there will be two separate ways of selecting this party of 10. That is, those three are surely selected. Three are in and you need an additional seven out of 25. Out of the remaining, right? Out of the remaining. Or three are out and you need, three are out and you need all 10 out of the remaining, right? So the number this or this is what will happen, right? This case is separate, this case is separate. If you have selected those three people out of 25, there are three and remaining 22. If you have selected three out of three, that is actually three C3 ways. Number of ways will be three C3 and into you have, you'll have to select seven out of the remaining 22. This is 22 C7. Okay. That's the number of ways for this particular case when those three are chosen. Plus, because of this or, if those three are excluded, you have to choose the remaining 10 from these 22. Out of these three, none are chosen. 3 C0. And out of 22, you select 10. So this is 22 C10. The number of ways would be 22 C7, 3 C3 times 22 C7. This is 1 and this is 1. This is 22 C10. Okay, 22 C7 plus 22 C10. That's the number of ways. And will we calculate this? 22 C10 will be very ugly. No, we'll not calculate this. We'll leave the answer at this stage. If you want, you can calculate this value on your own. Try it in your copies, right? That's the answer for this question over here. 